basically with all your round ones, quite obviously all the extroverted people stand out straight away. So we have to develop games where we can get those little interesting personalities and people that would be a bit quieter in a group environment and give them a chance to come through. So the games as a whole, we've, we've worked together with a psychologist to develop and we work out how to basically delve into everyone's personalities in a really short space of time. A lot of people think there's a bit of a secret casting trick in there. You're not going to get into the Big Brother house because you're really good at dancing like a chicken. Round two, uh, big mystery round, is very much a group dynamic sort of scenario where we ask people about their opinions on different things and then see how they interact with each other and with us. Um, it's not so much that we're looking at people's stories or them as sort of their history, but more about their opinions and the way that they express themselves. And actually more importantly than all that, kind of how they work in a group dynamic. It's really hard to say what it is that makes you go through the round three. Um, sometimes it's the loudest person in the room, sometimes we don't want the loudest person in the room, and sometimes someone might say one thing and that's enough, and it's not what they said, it could be how they said it. Just because you're a buffed up beefcake or you know a gorgeous girl doesn't qualify you immediately to get through the second round or you know, or indeed to get a one-on-one -on -one with me. I've been able to have intelligent and great conversations with nearly everybody who's come through to, to round three because the producers in the first round are working to a specific brief. You know, we are looking for intelligence, you know. It doesn't mean that you've got to be a rocket scientist to get in the house, but you know, it, it helps if you can hold a conversation. Round three is the final stage of the audition process, so if you've got to round three, you've already done very, very well. Uh, essentially, it is a one-on-one -on -one conversation with me. So, you know, more than any other show that's on television, um, you just can't say anything about Big Brother. We like to keep how the house is going to look secret. We obviously have to keep the housemates secret because if they know each other before, before we get in the house, well, then the social experiment is ruined, you know? The whole uh, premise of Big Brother is that it's X number of strangers going into the house that know nothing about their surroundings, know nothing about each other, and are locked away from the outside world for a given period of time. That's what Big Brother is, and that's why it is the original and the best. Mm -hmm.